Do you often find it inconvenient to carry your computer everywhere, especially when conducting construction site verifications or meeting with clients? If the answer is yes, did you consider using apps, rather than carrying your computer everywhere and printing all the project-related files, it is more efficient to use a mobile application for making on-the-spot modifications. So in today's video, we will explore a selection of the most useful mobile apps for architecture and architects available on Android. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Starting off with SketchUp Viewer, SketchUp Viewer offers 3D model viewing on mobile. This application is particularly friendly for use on construction sites, eliminating the need to carry a computer for project verification. Notably, it facilitates precise measurements with customizable units and precise settings. You can easily orbit and adjust viewing angles in addition to side of your projects to inspect various aspects from top to bottom. Another valuable feature is the ability to analyze and verify different project details by moving section plans. However, these plan sections must be initially created on the computer. Additionally, SketchUp Viewer offers on-the-spot information which can be needed in the presentation like services of volumes by clicking on the services of the components. You can also access saved scenes. However, it must also be made and saved on the computer first, which makes sense. This application provides flexibility to work with layers. You can easily switch between different perspectives such as bottom, left, and right, and you can also specify the different viewing type by choosing perspective or orthographic options. For further customization, you can activate shadows, show or hide geometry, axes, or section plans. The VR feature enhances visualization by integrating 3D models into a realistic environment for a better presentation. Next we have Chief Architect 3D Viewer. This app is aimed at viewing 3D models created by the same software on the computer, which is Chief Architect. The app is comprised of three primary tabs, the first for model selection, the second for viewing options, including the creation of horizontal or vertical sections, and a third tab for a camera function for navigating within the 3D environment. One standout feature that I like about this application is its friendly 3D navigation which can be easily controlled using the touchscreen gestures. You can also have the flexibility to activate the background camera to display the external environment. In summary, this app streamlines the process of viewing and interacting with 3D models created in Chief Architect, offering more convenience in presentation and functionality. Next, we have Room Sketcher. Room Sketcher is a distinct application from the previous two. I use this application to create 2D and 3D plans from scratch, and what impresses me is the automated handling of layers and separation of walls, windows, and furniture. One remarkable feature is its ability to differentiate between interior and exterior walls, making wall join incredibly easy and fluid. I can delete or move walls with a single click, which is particularly convenient when using a mobile application. The app boasts a comprehensive library of components, offering various types of windows, doors, furniture, and even kitchen cabinets. Another aspect that I appreciate about it is how organized it is. If I want to select a specific material like tiles, I can navigate to the material section, choose the desired texture, and apply to the floor with a simple click. Additionally, it is easy to rotate or resize objects and place them precisely where I want on the plan. And you can save plans in both 2D and 3D formats, and later download them to your device or print them directly. But if you want more options, we have Magic Plan. Magic Plan is an interesting mobile app to simplify plan generation. What I find impressive about it is its ability to capture measurements effortlessly using just the phone's camera. By scanning a room and pointing the camera at a wall, the application automatically records the wall length and height and can even detect windows and doors, which is interesting. Once the scanning is complete, the app generates a plan without the need for manual drawing, and the plan comes with numerous notes and illustrated images, and you can add additional notes if needed, which can be useful. The application offers a wide range of objects to include in your plan, 
such as doors, windows, and kitchen appliances. It also provides flexibility in adjusting wall dimensions or rearranging objects within the plan. Magic Plan also allows you to obtain area estimations, in addition to cost estimations and all the project specification required. However, the one drawback I noticed is that the precision may not be entirely accurate. When using the scanning option, there can be a tolerance of up to a half an inch or a few millimeters. Therefore, it is advisable to manually double check dimensions using a laser measurement tool. Now, if you want something simple, there is Home Design 3D. It is an incredibly user-friendly app that even non-designers can use. It guides you through the process of creating walls, adding doors and windows, and arranging furniture. And you can effortlessly switch between 2D and 3D views. But again, this app has some limitations in terms of precision. For instance, it doesn't provide the exact offset distance that you want when placing a door or a window. Additionally, the graphics and visual aspects of the application are relatively simple compared to other design applications. It is maybe suitable for amateur use and may not meet demands of professional designers. And of course we can't make a video like this without talking about the AutoCAD mobile app. This application offers a comprehensive toolset mirroring the main software. It includes drawing tools as well as key editing functions like copying, moving, and rotating objects. This application supports annotations, allowing you to mark specific areas in your plan and add notes. It also provides layer management for organizing and controlling object visibility. Additionally, you can import and rescale images, enabling measurements directly on pictures. Furthermore, it facilitates the review of DWG files created on a CAD software while working on site with clients outside of the office. Next we have Planner 5D, which is an easy app to use. It is suitable for both amateurs and those looking to design their own homes. Its interface is incredibly intuitive, making tasks like drawing plans and extending walls straightforward. The app automatically provides wall dimensions to ensure accuracy. The texture application is available for walls, tiles, and stairs and you can create multiple plans for different floors within a single file. Modifications can be made in both 2D and 3D design, and the application boasts a library filled with various models of doors, windows, and furniture. It can be ideal for those new to design or architecture. Due to how relatively simple it is and the manual nature of shifting and moving objects, which means it gives you a lot of control. Now we're going to mention the Autodesk Construction Cloud application. To use this app, you must first sign up for the Autodesk Cloud and save your projects there. This allows you to access and open your projects using the app. Notable features of this app is its ability to read a variety of plans, including AutoCAD plans, Revit plans, and mechanical and electrical plans in addition to 3D models. And it provides easy navigation and measurement taking capabilities. Next, we're going to talk about Coral CAD Mobile. This application is designed to complement the Coral CAD software. It offers a limited free version, and additional features will become available when you subscribe. This mobile application provides essential tools for 3D drawing, editing, and 3D viewing, making it convenient for use outside of the office. Additionally, it offers integration with popular cloud storage services such as Google Drive, Box, and Dropbox. And if you are looking for an interesting app, we have Planimeter, which is a specialized application designed with a unique concept, primarily catering to landscape designers and urban architects. It features an automatic tracking system where to input the longitude and the latitude of desired location. Once obtained, you can then proceed to measure the distances and areas directly on the map. Every app mentioned earlier has its own set of specific features and capabilities. As an architect, a student, or an amateur, you can select the one that most closely matches your project needs. And sometimes, you might find it necessary to use two or three different applications for a single project. However, it is important to note that mobile applications, while versatile, may offer fewer features compared to a fully-fledged computer software, and the main purpose of these apps 
is to complete the work of the software or to work remotely outside of your working place. So guys, if you found these apps interesting, you will find all the necessary links in the description. I hope you found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos similar to this one. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.